the mine of the future, we have to make it. It's not just something we're going to find. You know, these things that we do are all hard work. It, it gets more and more difficult every day. In the future, we have got tremendous opportunity to leverage exponential changes that are happening today in sensors, new technology such as robotics, and the accumulation of data that comes about because of that. These mines of the future are going to be all over the world because, as we all know, mining is a global business these days. And SME gives them the forum to intermix ideas and exchange that information with each other so that uh, we can move the industry forward. We want to talk about what is going on that is exciting in the mining industry right now. What has changed from our parents' and grandparents' mind. Right now, the industry has the challenge that we're not replacing one generation of workers, we're replacing two generations of workers. Those that are my age and older and who are retiring right now, plus the generation behind me that the industry never hired in the late 80s and the 90s. One of the ways we're trying to approach that is through the Mineral Education Committee and focusing on the K through 12 group and trying to get young people enthused about what we're doing in this industry. And I think getting that workforce starts with the small children. What we see is that we need to teach people how exciting it is to engage in careers that are based on math and science. Those are the kinds of skills that we're all going to need in more abundance in the future. We really do think that maintaining our universities is critically important to the global mining industry because of the skills and the talents and knowledge that our students come out with. Those, those people are going to be sought after worldwide. So it's the new face of mining because the people coming into the workforce have new faces. It's a very diverse, young set of talent, the best and the brightest coming in. But it's also a new face of mining in terms of how the mining industry presents itself to the public. Corporate social responsibility is part of that. We work on those fundamental things every day around relationships with our neighbors and the regulators that we work with. So even in times like these, economic times, uh, there is tremendous value to be created by increasing efficiency, by improving sustainability and safety. And so the mine of the future, you know, we don't know necessarily what it will be, but the whole point of the mine of the future is that mining is different. And, and that's the point of the new face of mining as well. We're working every day to, to build the mine of the future today. It's, you know, it's not some future esoteric thing. The mine of the future is important because we're talking about our future. We're talking about our kids' future, our grandkids' future. We're talking about society's future, everything we have. The technology is cool, and everybody you know, appreciates the use of computers and, and drones and things like that. But what it really comes down to is the mine has to be compatible with that community, and it has to produce social value. Economic value is necessary but not sufficient. You have to show them the social value for that project. That, to me, is going to define the mine of the future, because if you can't do that, there will not be a mine in the future.